this young lady has a really interesting story. Um, this is Marley, by the way. And this is my little buddy right here. And um, this is her mother, Lindsay, and Celeste, the pretty blue eyes. And she got sand all over her face and cupcake and the whole nine yards. Um, I'm going to let um, Lindsay share the story real quick. In August of 2010, um, I was 20 weeks pregnant with Marley when they found that she had um, severe congenital hydrocephalus and um, my, maternal fetal, my maternal fetal medicine doctor um, suggested that I have an abortion. They said that she would not have a very good quality of life and um, I disagreed. I mean, she's my child. Um, I continued my pregnancy. Um, she was born. She was given a shunt um, at a day old, and she has continued to to thrive. Um, I found God through through having Marley, and I've learned so much about life and about um, about myself as a person and a mother. Um, last Friday, um, I took Celeste to the doctor because um, I noticed that one of her feet was bigger than the other and that didn't really bother me but then shortly after that I noticed that one of her legs was also longer than the other one which I kind of thought well you know maybe she'll need a shoe lift it still didn't really concern me at the time and then uh, upon her appointment and um, examination from her doctor she found that half of her body is actually bigger than the other half so she was diagnosed with something called um, hemihyperplasia and um, that in itself is not really a big deal, but it predisposes her to get um, cancerous abdominal tumors. So um, her uh, abdominal ultrasound for that will be on Monday, and uh, we're really praying that it's going to be clear. Thank you for sharing, and we're going to be praying for everybody here in a little while, and we're going to pray for her as well. But uh, I sure am glad that you didn't listen to the doctors and abort Marley because... She's uh, touching hearts. She's not done yet. She's just getting started. Ain't she cute, huh? I need one of these. Thank you. Thank you for sharing your story.